Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another video. I am back and we got lots of content in store. Um, today, we actually are out here combining. It is August 7th and we started yesterday, August 6th, and we are combining some wheat right now. It is crazy, crazy early to be combining, but the wheat is ready and it's not running very good because of the drought. Uh, I think we're kind of 15 bushel an acre would be we'd be happy with but right now we're on grain cart duty and I will never complain about being on grain cart duty when I have this bad boy that is right we are running a Fent 933 a 330 horsepower Fent tractor on our grain cart so I'm doing the trucking and the grain cart driving even though it's not a very busy job this year. I will I will take it, that's my job so far. And we got one combine way down there and another combine right there. So I should jump in this bent tractor and we should go wait for some grain. So now we're gonna just release the parking brake, our air parking brake, and we can see we are in foot pedal mode, which is a grain cart driver's dream. We go into forward with that little foot pedal, start pushing it down, and just like a car, we're cruising, cruising through the field. The farther I push down, the faster I'm gonna go, and I do not have to worry about shifting any gears, uh, going forward or backwards. Don't have to worry about anything with this CVT, this continuously variable transmission. I just bomb along. It is, it is nice and that's why I said I will never complain about being a grain cart driver when you're in one of these fence. So this is my brother Connor, his first year home for harvest, not being away for school, and he is driving the 9795 Massey Combine, and boy is it nice to have him out here. An extra hand helping out, and he's been loving every minute of it. And he's driving the Combine, so he's always got a smile on his face. So this video I want to be talking about, are these Fent tractors great grain cart tractors? And I guess we'll start off with what I really, really like about these bent tractors on the grain cart. And that is the CVT transmission in these Fent Vario tractors. It is unbelievable for driving with our foot pedal mode or driving with our joystick, just not having to shift through any gears, just cruise right along the field, get up to the combine, or get back to the semi, it is just absolutely awesome. I also really like the hydraulic setup in these Fent tractors, being able to customize exactly which hydraulics are where and where you want them placed. Another reason why I really truly think these Fent tractors are awesome grain cart tractors is because of this front suspension. That front axle suspension really smooths things down when you're bombing through the field across each row here it smooths things quite a bit so in all honesty i have nothing bad to say about these fent tractors being grain cart tractors i truly think they are absolutely phenomenal 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 for this job other than two things that are actually pretty easy to change well one of them is pretty easy to change but the other is just take some getting used to uh, and I will mention these right now so that first thing that is very easy to change is actually just because it's a front wheel assist tractor you sit so much lower than a big four-wheel drive like a big versatile Delta track so what I mean by that is kind of a pain in the butt is I cannot see actually in to my grain cart 
And also, when I'm loading the truck, I can't see into the truck. But how I would easily solve that problem would be to put a camera. I'd put a camera right here on the grain cart. This way, I can see how much is in my grain cart. I can see if the combine's coming in and loading. I can see exactly where it all is. So that would be my first camera. And my second camera would be right on the end of that spout there. Just so then that way I can see into the truck as I'm filling, I can see how full it is, uh, where I need to go, where I need to shoot that grain. And that would be the nice, easy two spots to put a camera to fix that issue of it being just a fair bit lower than a versatile Delta track. So the second thing that I guess it more or less takes getting used to is that this tractor is not a big four wheel drive articulating tractor. With this grain cart, I actually don't have an adjustable spout, so I can't control and shoot that grain kind of wherever it needs to go in the semi. That's a fixed spout and everything's fixed on this auger. So with the articulating tractor before, I could get right nice and close to the semi and then I could just turn the wheel and it would actually turn the whole grain cart and that grain I could shoot into the far side of the trailer a little easier. Um, with this, since it is a front wheel assist, I can't do that, but that problem could easily get eliminated by a spout that you can adjust. And anyways, most newer grain carts do come with a spout that you can adjust for that exact reason. So you can shoot it into the far side of the trailer or kind of find whichever spots that you need to, to put that grain in. So I really do love these uh, Fent tractors as grain cart tractors. I probably would take one over anything else for a grain cart tractor because they are so awesome and so nice. Um, we actually have quite a few customers that do run these as grain cart tractors because of that front axle suspension, the cab suspension, the nice luxury cab and having all those things right at uh, hydraulic remotes right at your fingertips and that CVT transmission. I love driving this thing as a grain cart and that's why I said at the start of this video, I will not complain being the grain cart driver with this thing. But that's gonna be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and we got lots of stuff coming soon. So please leave a like and hit that subscribe button down below and let me know if you drive one of these fent tractors as a grain cart. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.